Testing. All right, sounds good. Let's go ahead and get into it. We said on Twitter. Figured the Ashwinders, we did uh, the first Merlin trial, so we're going to be moving on from there. Once the shaders are prepared. this up because it doesn't like to stay on and uh load this uh right here merlin trial yep we just finished this first merlin trial and uh simple we just had to set some things on fire we had to use the right thing all right so we also got to save this um this uh what do you call it goblin camp this goblin stuff do the mini quests what is this oh there's a merlin trial right there all right, let's go do the Merlin trial first, and then we'll go save that goblin zone. Rebellion. That goblin stuff. I think we have some gear. This guy, we're gonna sell our stuff. Hello, Mr. Sammy. What can I do for you? Uh, you already asked him about all this, right? There's a thief on the loose by the name of. She's stealing everything that's not nailed down, and people have had enough. Catherine's hiding in a camp just southwest of town. Oh, there's something new. Okay. What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? Just need to sell this stuff. They're a big guy. Oh, okay. I hope to see you again sometime. I still miss with you. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. Swift or sweet.
Okay, what do we gotta do now? Oh, we gotta move these balls in there, I think. Oh, okay. Well, that was much easier than uh, I thought it was going to be. All right, is there another one? Did we finish it? Uh, oh, there's more over here. Here we go. Uh, that was easy. Alright, one more, I think. Here we go. Perfect. All these Merlin trials are shit, bro. Not challenging at all. What is this? Rebellion. So okay. All right, let's go get the uh, goblin stuff. What is this? He witches and wizards correctly trace the history of Scotland's indigenous mazes back to their rightful source. 15th century dark wizard known as Unan Blackwood. Born Unan Wood to a non-magical branch of the Wood family, Unan was misunderstood by his medical parents and in an effort to fit in, thought solace in the family trade hedge trimming. He could allegedly control the blackthorn bushes with his mind, creating beautiful designs with ease. This both impressed and infuriated his rather intolerant family. Their resentment only worsened upon young Yunnan's invitation to Hogwarts, where he was sorted into Hufflepuff House. It was at Hogwarts that Yunnan first met on one Artemisia Black. So that must be a relative of the black guy now. Uh, disowned by the black family for his mother's dialance. Dalance? Uh, with Artemis' muggle father and half blood Artemis's. Uh, relationship with blood purity was a complex one. She considered herself worthy of her mother's maiden name and blamed her father for her ostracization. At the same time, she did not fault Wood for his muggle percentage, but rather considered him to an unwilling, innocent victim of muggle impurity. What is that noise over here? What are y'all doing? Are y'all peeing on each other? Y'all need to chill out. Okay? Eat. Rebellion. What do we do here? Do we set it on fire? Don't set it on fire. Okay, interesting. Uh. We get to hit stuff from far away. back shooters oh there's spiders did i get him did i kill them all i killed them all this oh a spider thing we got a spider thing interesting what's up sheepy you are a tough sheep. Okay. Interesting. Beasts welcome. Oh, I'm a beast. Must not have heard about me in my uh, cross wands experimentation. What is this? Oh. Rebellion. He breeding black scale. The hybriding black is a large dragon that can grow to over nine meters in length. The large rough scale originally belonging to one of the beasts is one of the prized possessions of Archaea Bickle. Keeps in its hideout. Completed a challenge.
the kill guy pages in the highlands highland explorer cap all right so that's done increase storage for gear oh yeah 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 yeah, yeah. we need that Oh, if you do the Merlin Trials, you get more gear slots. Dope. Okay, every time we see it, we're going to complete one of them. Uh, combat. Gear trait receipt, recipe reward, amphibial protection one. Defeat 10 dark wizards, dragon high protector's cloak. Nice. That looks pretty cool, actually. Defeat five. Doug Boggs. Defeat Spiders. Spider Slayer Armor. That's pretty cool. Complete five dueling feats. Okay. All right. Nice. I like it. What was that? Top of class in song. We'll complete four assignments. We still don't have this, whatever this is. The room of requirement. We got four new inventory slots. Nice. Okay. Me likey. I think this is a Merlin troll. Here we go. Inventory slots. What do you have in store for me this time? Probably something stupid and easy. Oh, God. Oh. One more. Okay. No. Try hiding. Okay, is there more? Yep. Oh, oh, uh, yeah, that was my bad. That was my bad, Wolfie. Like grab that wolf. <laughs> okay. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. A lot of these mongrels over here. Is the uh, rest this Merlin stuff, bro? That's the right thing to do here, right? Oh. I myself would be proud. Bam. Super sample. Nice. Rebellion. Nice. guys stuff back a 
past the ruins. I'm on the right track. I heard another one coming up. Out of the ground. And past the ruins. Fieldcroft, Hogwarts. Over there. There we go. An encampment. This must be it. Let's get this over with. Eat Gugans. I'm going to put this on that. Looks as if there's more than one way to enter. I will regret not joining us. He doesn't cut round now. He'll be made even more of an example. Try to kill that traitor. Scout it out really quick. Steal this ranger's crossbow bolt. I do that. Defend an enemy with a venomous tentacula. I don't have a venomous tentacula. Unfortunately. Revelio. Merlin thing in here. Just go all ham. Nobody's here, big guy. knows where I'm at. It's like there's really only one way in. How many of you are there? <laughs> you got stuck in the ground, that's funny. Yeah, how many are there? Is there a wizard summoning them? What's going on? Never anything I can't see anywhere, anywhere to get in. Or like that. Interesting, okay. Really big. Okay. All right, let's go in the front door. Is this dismember not dismember this one? Whoa. 
Let this serve as a warning to others too young to know okay. better. You guys are pretty good. I was learning. Kind of get the feel. Looks as if there's more than one way to enter. Right, let's do it again. How many of you are there? How nice of you to stop by. What am I Facing the wrong way. Easily diverted. Let me go, Parkour, bro. Thing's gonna go somewhere. Oh, there's one right here. Here we go. Here we go, got that one. Go to your master. Quite an enchantment. The carts are returning to arm. Revelio. Comes in top hat. Yeah. 
Boom. I need one more, and I think it's out here. Where are the balls? Revelio. Where are the balls? There we go. Accio. Incendio. Accio. Found the balls, guys. You didn't work. I am not impressed with the Merlin Trials. Not impressed at all. So you get resistance. Gear traits. Oh, okay. That's how you get traits. Alright, cool. We're done with that. What is next? Oh, we gotta go talk to the guy now. Oh, he moved. He moved. Alright, we're gonna take a different path. I wanna see what's down here. Up with this cave. some of those. Oops. I got there's duelist things. So what is this? What is what is this right here? Bunch of fishies. Rebellion. There's a thing up there. Uh. Is mongrel lear den inhibited by mongrels? Okay, I guess it was just a den. Interesting. something else I wanted to see. What is this? Treasure Vault. Hell yeah. Let's check this out. I like treasure. I like money. This looks intriguing. It does, doesn't it? What is this? Accio. Huh. Gotta be more on the sides. No? Oh, this right here. Here we go. Okay. It's a little dark down here. So these are just treasure vaults, okay. Not actual dungeons. Rebellion. Oh, there's... it's underground. Oh, 
we gotta get it to come up somehow. How do we do this? Something to do with the stairs. Sides. Pretty interesting. Nothing. Cool. Nice doing business with you. Wigan Will Potions. Dutch bag. I just need to beat y'all up a little bit. I've got the dug bag tongue. how you got it the first time I did it. I was just like, oh, it's far away. Let's hit it. Apparently, you can only get it through Accio. Uh. Right. What's up, my dude? Where's this chest at? Oh, it's in there. Can't get in there. I'm afraid I'm afraid the still don't have my carts. What are you talking about? I sent oh, them. I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I, to, I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good in wizard kind. Oh, thank you for proving them wrong. Yeah, it was no trouble. I managed to free your carts fairly easily. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> you know, you've inspired me. Ooh. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. Yeah, sounds like a good idea. What a nice idea, Ron. I wish you luck with it. Oh, I can't wait to get started. Uh, thank you again for all you've done. Yeah, no problem, Ron. All the best. Hello, Mr. Sammy. Uh, what do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? Just want to sell my stuff. Try to keep it empty I'll inventory. See you again sometime. Yeah. All right, cool. We did that. Did that real like good, but place right out of a storybook. Is awesome. Very nice, very nice, yes, okay. All right, so what is our quest? Rope's last hope. House elf may have a clue to the missing pages I seek. 
should find out more. Find Scrope's note in the courtyard. Okay. at that after this this mission we'll do some more sides after the main course scrope knows about the book you found is it missing something scorp does not believe it is safe to speak out in the open rope has left another note across the bridge among the circle of rocks take care tell no one about this scrope who is scrope i think is that that elf or whatever the elf right or is it a goblin? I don't know. Let's check him out. I don't know. He sounds a little sus, man. Sounds a little sus. We need that. It's right there. Almost there. Head for the pumpkins. Just down from stone circle. Look inside one of them. You may be able to help poor broken-hearted screw. Pumpkins? Ah. I think I know just the place. Pumpkins. Gotta find the pumpkins. I wonder what those balloons are for. Am I gonna get jumped? I might get jumped. Be a bad idea for them to jump me. What's up, Scarecrow, dude? Rebellion. Aha, here we go. <sighs> Young Slytherin must be exceptionally curious by now. Meet Scrope at the water's edge by the broken docks. Down to the water's edge? Hmm. This had better not be a trick. Right? That's what I'm what? saying. It's a freaking trick, my oh. guy. Can't trust nobody named Scrope. My name is Scrope. It's a Merlin thing. Broken uh. Merlin thing. Oh, you beat up, bro. Right. Thank you for coming all this way. The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. I've been in the Black family for years. Oh, that's Apologies why you're beat the up. Abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't followed. What's this all about? Your notes mention the book I found in the restricted section. Scrope can tell you more in exchange for your help, but no one, especially the headmaster, can know. Yeah, sure. I do for you. I'd rather not risk trouble with Black. Happy to undermine authority if it benefits me. <laughs> Happy to help. Especially if you can shed light on the book. Scrope is grateful. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black, may she rest in peace, was a student at Hogwarts uh, over 50 years ago. Before she died, she mistress spoke with some. passion of pages ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. She was delirious at the end, poor thing. Mistook Belladonna for elderberries. <laughs> Scrope tried to warn her. I'm sorry to hear that. But how do you benefit if I find the pages? Scrope believes that a treasured Black family ring is also in the grotto. Scrope wishes to give it to the headmaster. Apollonia forbade Scrope from entering the grotto long ago. Scrope continues to honor her wishes. Scrope would not dare ask a student for help, but when Scrope learned you were looking for those pages, Scrope thought you might also find the <coughs> ring. How did you know about the book I found? How did you know that I'd found a book and that it's missing pages? Scrope and the other house elves are good at staying out of sight. Scrope hears and sees many things in the castle. Scrope knows how to keep secrets. Better keep a secret. 
Or I'll find Scroop. Mess Scroop up. Tell me more about this treasured ring. Oh, it's adorned with the Black Family Crest. The Headmaster would be pleased with Scroop for returning it. You'd probably also be wondering where you got it from. Mm, I don't know. How did you injure your ear? The Blacks have a tradition of decapitating their house elves when their service is no longer required. Wow. One day, dear Apollonia was understandably frustrated with Scrope and got a bit too eager with a cleaver. Scrope was able to convince the sweet girl of his value and now views this small injury as a reminder of her good heart. Decapitates their elves? They are... I don't like him. I don't like him one bit. It seems this may help us both. Um, I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing to help. And take this toast to the grotto just down the coast. And place it on the pedestal there. Good luck. Toast? Like an actual piece of toast? Scrope will wait right here for you. Best of luck finding your pages. And the ring. Revelio. Actual piece of toast. Okay. What was it you needed me to do, Scrope? Scrope would never presume to need anything from a student. <laughs> Scrope simply thought that you might find the pages you seek in Apollonia's Grotto. And that if you were to go there, you might also find the Black Family Ring. <laughs> okay. It seems this may help us. Scrope, take this toast to the gr Good luck. All right. You gotta take some toast to some grotto, apparently. Interesting. Interesting. Rebellion. I expect something behind every waterfall. Oh shit. The oil is useful for dealing with higher level combat situations. Combat plants and potions can give you advantage. Is that a freaking Kraken, bro? Ooh. Yeah, get that. Take some of this cabbage. Oh, you're stuck. Oh, you're not stuck anymore. There you take my cabbage out, you jerk. Another one. Strong, bro. one really quick. Oh. 
There's another one. Just uh, disappeared. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, I just uh, I saw that and I was like, oh, I only need a little bit more. And then I warped over, uh, rolled over to it, got it, and then he just up and disappeared. Gear trait recipe rewarded. Defeat five Duke Bags. Amphibial protection. Weakness protection. What else we got? Revelio. There was a freaking crack in in here. I saw it. guy never told me about no duke bogs and krakens and right <laughs> is there anything over here no <laughs> this is pretty neat it's a big squid bro why would I need a piece of toast? Now it's all soggy I and shit. suppose that's where it goes. Okay, you feed toast to... Giant squid. Yo, Foxy, hey. It's been a while, yeah, I remember. Why are you ghosting me? I'm not ghosting you. Why are you ghosting me? I just looked over in my bed. <laughs> How's it going? So we fed a piece of toast to a uh, Kraken looking thing. Cleaner's black journal. Could it be a visitor? Who are you? How you been though, Foxy? Oh, ah. Ooh. <laughs> ah. The name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student, just like you, about a century ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah. Sorry to say, I sold the ring a long time what ago. What Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, <coughs> tossed to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. But she simply rolled her eyes. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? <laughs> Not my finest moment. Did you finally beat the Choo Choo Charles? I did beat Choo Choo Charles. Oh, uh, you've been busy with stuff? I've been busy with stuff too. I just got over being sick for a full freaking seven day week. It was terrible. Uh, what would you, you yellowed old pages torn from a book? Yeah, I want them. I'd like to have those pages, if you don't mind. They're not here. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So, I followed the map to what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And 
You see what happens next. Here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll show you where to find the pages. Uh, how'd you lose your head? I think I could guess how you died, but who did it to you? I was having a look around when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze. After that, I felt, well, lightheaded. That's all I remember. Hence, if you do visit the cave, be prepared. <laughs> I can't tell you what for specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate the congrats. This is a new game. This is Hogwarts Legacy. Why did I need the toast to get in here? Oh, that was Apollonia's idea. Seems some squids love toast. They should have taught you that at Hogwarts. Yeah, I missed that class. My bad. How was it possible to steal from Peeves, a poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. He has a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor. Whatever's sure to cause the most chaos. He dropped them after yeah, a particularly aggressive romp through the library. Interesting, interesting. All right, I'll see you at the forest. I suppose if that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, <laughs> my decapitated skeleton, they're yours for the taking. Yeah, no problem. I don't mind that. I don't mind that at all. Nice, I'll be watching for a while. Got you, Foxy. You haven't heard of uh, Hogwarts Legacy? There's a skeleton right there. Oh, it's a map. It's a treasure map. Okay, forced. We gotta do Lumos over bridge through the woods, grandmother's house to go. Uh, and then we got some candle lights, and then we got that. Okay. Hmm, a map. Keep on it my doesn't own. appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Yup. Where did you suggest we meet? Near the Forbidden Fox. Okay. I suppose if that. I'm. Sh if you don't. All right. Well, that was uh. That was not what I expected. <sighs> it's so pretty. Look at it. I've been watching the last one of Harry Potter, so I think so. Are you talking about the last Harry Potter movie? Huh. What's up, Scrope? Hello, Scrope. Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollonia's Grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Wow. Oh, what of the Black family ring? I'm sorry to say that Jack Dawes sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Mm -hmm. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress the headmaster. Well, Scrope takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scrope. You're a credit to house elves. For sure, bro. Try to keep your head about you. Hopefully they don't decapitate you soon. Okay. So Foxy, what's your uh what's your favorite um movie? After completing this game, you're gonna try playing some FNAF games? Uh, I don't know, maybe. I don't have any of them. I never really found them, you know, anything that I'm interested in, but probably check out. There's jump scares for jump scares, so. Probably needs something else. Can't push it. 
Can't lift it. Can't pull it. Probably need something to, like, just push it down that way. Okay, we'll, we'll come back to this. Favorite movie is Halloween Kills. That's Michael Myers, right? Alright, let's see. What quests do we have? Ghost of Richard Jack Doll is going to meet the edge of the Forbidden Forest. He said he'll show me how to get the cave where he died. He's certain missing pages. Okay. Ghost of Our Love. Matt portrays a forest bridge of candles. Let's go back to Hogwarts. Oh, man, the Forbidden Forest is way up there. I go to the Forbidden Forest. Yeah, let's go to the Forbidden Forest. I'm more of a Jason Voorhees guy. How nice to see you, my young friend. What is FNAF you see in? But yeah, I'm more of a, what do you call it? Um, Jason Voorhees type filler. I like the machete. Got a bigger knife. Rebellion. Alright, here we go. Off the forbidden forest we go. We'll be fine. Ain't worry about nothing. Caution, centaurs, frogs, cold here. Dangerous. By time, Ministry of Magic. Oh, the area is considered dangerous by the Ministry of Magic. Who put this here is not funny. Yeah, who? Da how dare them? Got chickens. Get out of here, chickens. Well, Forbidden Forest is uh, a jerk, and I kind of understand um, why it's forbidden. Yeah, makes sense now. And you are correct. That is my opinion. It is the correct opinion. It is the only opinion. Oh, I messed that up. Pick the battle without using weak move potion. Boom. Nailed it. Let's try. Not a problem. No issues whatsoever. It's a dur. This is not the bridge I'm looking for. Oh, these are poachers. I kind of want to mess them up. Thank <laughs> you. 
play games for fun and I don't really care if people sub to me and I'm just in it for fun. Yeah, same here. Not appropriately named. Not appropriately named. You know what? Your face not appropriately named. I'm out, man, you know. Whoa, okay, you found me. Good job. He's gonna whoop my butt. Careful, we need more potions, bro. Be right back, all right. Foxy. Revelio. Ancient magic focus too. It's a trait. See what's down here. I should investigate. Ooh, what is this? I have a bad feeling about jumping in there. Let's do it. Garb. Oh, it's just a uh, cave. Okay. Nice. How do you add traits? I guess I haven't learned how to add a trait yet. <laughs> All right, let's go. We have no wigan will potions. Hopefully we won't need them. Darn. 
in there. I was hoping for some potions. Here I am, as good as my... We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It took the cunning of a Slytherin to track down these pages. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say Intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Oh, there's the bridge. I think that's the bridge that I need. Aside from the bird bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. Ooh, you'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Well, this is not good. We're going in the spider den. Hmm. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Is that Latin? Or Greek? Hmm. I think it's French. Okay, we need health potions. So we're gonna go and we're going to find health potions. Oh, we can't leave. Hmm. Okay. Like this is just the way Handy it goes. Handy resource indeed. Your field guide. Nothing to do now but keep going. Mm hmm. Revelio. Okay. There's people here. Ah, let's sneak up on them. Mess them up. time it right, you can push your projectile back towards them. Get out here, chickens. The crazies. Oh, they're centaurs. Oh no, centaurs are bad. The waterfall. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. Yeah, right. Oops! My bad. Alright, looks like we gotta go to the waterfall. <laughs> Distinguished school club, nice. Okay, nothing. Oh, it's a fishy. Get out of your fishies. I think we gotta go up. See how cool this distinguished cloak looks like. Oh, we can't put it on. Hmm. Okay. Boo. Ugh. Revelio. Creatures up here. What are those creatures? Huh. 
something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. Yeah, this doesn't look too bad. Oh, get out of here, deer. What is this place? There it is. Just as Jackal described. Incendio. Okay, can't do that there. Boom. Rebellion. Oh, that looks like a secret passageway. This river has Oh, yeah. Here we go. Hey, nice. Aren't you Ooh. a little far from home? Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. But, uh... You can't imagine. No risk those loyalists will report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jack Doris let me. Went a little better than I was hoping for. You just need potions, bro. You need potions. Ooh, this is cool. In case my game, my computer crashes again, restarts. Combat. Beat ten dark wizards. Yes, we did. Protectors ensemble gear appearance reward. Defeat twenty dark wizards. And check out that uh that cloak. We need to figure out how to use those uh traits, man. Does it have a hood? It doesn't have a hood. It's not bad. It doesn't have a hood though. I wonder how big this place is. Let's look here. Oh, there's spiders. Rebellion. Using better gear with higher stats will help you fight higher level enemies. Gotcha. I've been doing this for a while now. Yep, and that's exactly what they were. Very impressive. Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. What a tomb, bro. What a tomb. I wonder if any of my spells through this. Obviously, fire. Shit. Hey, that was better. You gotta be careful. We don't want to. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, all right, let's go down. Let's see what's downstairs. Let's see what's down here. Oh, we gotta go that way. Zero. There's not a map. Okay, well, let's go through here first. And let's see. There's only three of them. That should be good. There's a lot more. Ooh, okay. Yeah, you don't like fire, do you, you bitch? around it. That's pretty cool. I don't mind it, but we're going to go back to our normal one. Should be able to just slide, man. That would have been great. Alright, which way do we go? This way. It's the other way is the right way. Platform ought to be able to float straight to me. <laughs> oh, yeah, we touched chest. Territor wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Making will potion, yeah, yeah, he's lying. Oh, he's lying. We're gonna get screwed. Perfect. What's this? That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loop, but there's no sign of him. He must have never gotten here. <laughs> Didn't he leaves? Didn't he leaves? Nice, nice. The chest here. Revelio. How do I get over there? There? Did I miss it? Alright, let's go back and see because I think maybe I missed it. Can't get up there. Oh, okay, it's somewhere else. Probably swoop back around. Oh, it's behind. Came down from behind and tried to get me. Another puzzle. I'd have 
Jackdaw could solve this, so can I. I'm really a puzzle, bro. Just hit it with a wand and we're good. Perhaps the next symbol is hidden somewhere. Perhaps. Oh, there we go. Ooh, okay. Oh, that's pretty neat. That's a bridge. I was thinking it's like some kind of magic dragon and stuff. I have a feeling we're missing something. Revelio. You gotta be missing something. Oh, spiders. Oh, you spider guys. Just I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? I don't know. too bad. I mean, no way out, but... Alright, let's see. Let's see what's over here. Revelio. There's another way to go. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, well. Now I hate this shooter as it prepares to attack. I didn't do that, so okay. Oopsie poo. Alright, let's see here. Not a big armor guy. I mean, I like it near the medieval times, but not like this. An untouched chest. Tactal wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Oh, no, he kind of sucks. He's like the worst thief ever. Ever. Jackpool would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. Jackdaw left a little something behind him. Hey, you got some weak little potions. Woo woo. Woo. Freaking woo. It's almost complete. We gotta go that way. Right, let's go back this way and see if we missed anything. Oh, that's not where we go. This way. Almost to level. No, we need level 19. Oh, we're almost level 19. Thank you. 
They're, they're gonna be pretty awesome. That matriarch. It's down here. Okay, so we have one here. Oh. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. There. There. I need to look around for the symbol. Is there another one? One, two, three. Soldiers at the end. Guardians. Must be getting closer to Jackdaw's remains and those pages. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. Yeah, I, I see. Uh, I see how he lost his head. A lot of um, soldiers here. That reflection, that reflection is real nice. Like, yeah. Here it is, the map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? <laughs> Possibly. Expelliarmus. All right. 
right, we got the big boys. Let's go. <laughs> One more time. Oh, you're much bigger. Hey, I can't live you so him. Crazy smart. You knew that before. How am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? Wow. It's awesome. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Can we get to the door? I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. Come on, open the door. this place I'm so confused why why do that Revelio. I don't get why I did that Oh, that's the that's the main dude, the guy from the memories. What's up? It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention, and might I presume you share our ability to see traces of ancient magic yes sir i do as you have likely realized by now our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic we can access expressions of magic that few others can opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent do not squander them i won't professor <laughs> thank you we have much to discuss but first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. Uh, where is here, though? The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside. Those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. Nope. 
Why is this called the map chamber? I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. Okay, I'll bring the book here then. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book <clears throat> is in place. Watch she be like the bad guy. Your connection to ancient magic has unlocked talents. Plus one, you will receive one talent point each time you increase your wizarding level. You have new talent and points to spend and talents when you have field guide. Okay. Earn talent points starting at level five. You may spend these talent points as you wish to enhance your spells to increase your combat power, stealth, and more. Use wisely. Talent points may only be spent once. So the number of talents you acquire will be limited. Turn here often to see what new and powerful talents await you. Oh, wow. You got like a RPG tree. Look at this. Okay. Let's see what spells are. I think Sidio unleashes a ring of flame around you. Okay. That's pretty cool. I like that. Enemies near a target summoned by Ekio are also pulled towards you. That's not bad. Levioso Mastery. Enemies near a target levitated by Levioso are also levitated. Nice. Confringo. And, uh, what is this? Transformation Mastery. Okay, so spells. Dark Arts. Purchase talents points. Deal damage to a cursed target, inflicting damage to all cursed targets. Stupefy has the same effect as a curse on enemies. Cursed enemies take increased damage. Oh, nice. <clears throat> That's not bad. Spilliaramus has the same effect as a curse on enemies. Cursed enemies take increased damage. <clears throat> okay. Cursed effect remains on enemy for a longer period of time. Enduring curse. They attack each other, what? Okay, so we can curse people. Core. Holding down dodge allows you to vanish quickly and reappear nearby. Ooh. I like that. Let's go ahead and get that. Oh. <clears throat> okay. Protego absorption. Successful Protego blocks will contribute to the ancient magic meter. Protego blocks contribute even more. Now let's go ahead and grab that. <laughs> Basic cast impacts reduce spell cooldowns. And let's do that. Ancient magic throw catches and throws disarmed enemy weapons. Yeah, that sounds cool. New spell set is added. Hold RT and tap in a direction to swap to an unlock spell set. What? Ew, that's cool. Yes. Oh, you can have three spell sets? Nice. Yes, healing. Need healing. You can have four spell sets? Nice.
back one second. Get everything set back up. really quick from a little hungry I've only had coffee this morning so Unidentified bat item. Take this to the room of re requirement to reveal its qualities. What? I don't have room of requirements. How do I get that? What do I do? Revelio. Huh. I guess let's leave. Oh, that cheese stick was good. That cheese stick was really good. I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? Yeah, right? Maybe the book has a soul in it. Come on, cheese stick, open up. Maybe it has a soul of that little girl in it. And she became evil and they trapped her soul in that, that book. God, burn it. You cheese jerk. All right, where are we coming out at? What are you up to now? Mmm. I had a feeling this was it. I had a feeling this is where we were. I'm back at Hogwarts. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he was away. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Yeah, that is true. Oh, it's a frog statue. Those things warp your places. Where's the other frog statue, though? Hmm. Hmm. Here's the question. <laughs> You oh, it's need there. to learn to pulso, the banishing charm. Useful for pushing objects or adversaries away. Complete the required tasks and meet me in my classroom. Where do I get the unlocko spell? That's really what I want. I want the unlocko spell. Goes the uh, okay. Okay, I want to know if there's any. There is here. Sending for sweets. It appears that Gareth Weasley wants to speak with me. Talk to Gareth Weasley. All right, let's go talk to him really quick.
It's been a while since I've been up here. There's one of those chambers. I need a key. Revelio. Is that it? Behind the staircase? I think so. Here we go. Where'd you go? Yeah, there you are. <laughs> it's hard to see it. It's so dark. That's such a small time span. I have not been out here yet. Revelio. Numbers, okay. So, oh, is there numbers anywhere? Here we go. So, this one is four. Four. Where's that one? Two. Three is a triangle, a circle. One is a triangle with this line. It's one, one, three. Home! Twelve Hogwarts secrets. What? What did I do? What did I solve? I solved something. Oh no. Oh no, am Revelio. I trapped down here? Feels gray and bronze. Nice. What's up, Raddy? Collection of the rest. Unidentified head item. What? <sighs> Solve one gray on secret solver's bathing costume. What? the room of requirement. I'd love to know. Revelio. Underground harbor. It's a werewolf, bro. Expelliarmus. That's not what I meant. Lumos. 
dragon statue. around here. Loops back around. Revelio. Gargoyle. Although the smoke breathing gargoyle might appear to be enchanted, it's actually a, a Hufflepuff common room chimney. Oh, really? That's pretty cool. Revelio. So we're on top of the Hufflepuff common room. I want to mess something up. We we'll stick something down in the Hufflepuff chimney. No one will be the wiser. Man, this is cool. This is a good little fight over here, man. Look at this. Revelio. It's got to be the Hufflepuff common room. Always. That's the bridge. This, this castle is huge, bro. It's huge. This is the... That's where it goes. It's through here. Oh, okay. This is the bridge back across to the Dark Arts Tower. Okay. Okay, alright. That's where that key goes. Alright, let's go get that key. Where'd you go, key? There we go. Nice 
nice coffee. Okay, let's go. Let's see if we can find that moth. I think the moth is over here on this side of the the main entrance. Is that noise? Revelio. Music. Right. It's ominous, isn't it? down there. There you are. <laughs> mm, that's set up. Gareth. I was. After you helped me with that frooper feather and potions, I reckoned you might be just the person I need. You see, I have an idea for a fizzing, wisby inspired beverage, but I'm missing a key ingredient. Uh, sure. You and your concoctions. I don't know how you come up with these things. It's a gift, truly. So, I suspect the key ingredient in fizzing Wisbies is dried billywig stings. I heard there's a store of them in Honeyduke's cellar. I'd get them myself, but my Aunt Matilda has her eye on me. Thinks I need to focus on potions class for a while, not for my own bruise. I was hoping you could Probably follow a, a secret idea, passage bro. to Honeyduke's cellar and grab a few dried billywig stings for me. Uh... Untoward secret passage. In my street. Of course. You never know when you might need a quick means of escape from the castle. Brilliant, thank you. But you should know that it's not exactly quick. It's the secret bit that's helpful. The passage is hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch in the third floor corridor. Just tap it with your wand and say, Descendium. I know where that is. It's on by the Couldn't you have someone buy the dried billywigs things? They're not for sale, and you never know when the cellar's going to be locked. So. The reliable way in and out is through the secret entrance. Are you asking me to steal from a shop? Goodness! It's not as if I'm asking you to rob Gringotts. Honey Dukes is more than enough, and I only need a few. It's a sweets ingredient. They won't be missed. Trust me. Sure, I'll, I'll see what I can do, Gareth. Fair enough. 
You shall be the first one to taste my newest brew if you can be of help. Perhaps I can convince a meat to help me with my potions homework. Get my aunt to loosen her reins a bit. Yeah, you need to start doing stuff a little bit better, bro. I'll need to get those dried billywigs things for Gareth if he's to finish his latest concoction. A one-eyed witch statue shouldn't cool. be too hard to find. What is this? Rebellion. These large ornate hourglasses containing rubies, diamonds, sapphires, and emeralds are enchanted to keep count of house points for Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and Slytherin respectively. Oh, nice. I like that. I like that a lot. But it doesn't look like anybody's got points right now. That was so upsetting. Here. Revelio. Expelliarmus. Oops. My bad. Lumos. Oh, this is the main hall. Rebellion. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. The Great Hall has been bewitched to mimic the sky above the castle. It's pretty cool. Yeah, it's pretty neat. This enchanted lectern serves as a spot from which the great headmistress and headmasters of Hogwarts, as well as Professor Black, address the school. Wow, well, is it enchanted? Enchanted for what? Lumos. Mom. Moth guy. That's not what I meant to do. Lumos. I was like, where'd it go? What the hell? Let's see if there's anything else in here. Who's down here? Oh, it's a secret. Okay, secret door. Uh, 11 and 0. I need 3 on the double question mark. And then this one, 7 and 9, that's 16, 16, uh, 4, 4, 8, and the 8. Till Ensemble. Oh. oh, I can't jump over. Rebellion. Okay. Locks. Where's this go? Okay, the Hufflepuff chimney thing. Let's see what's upstairs. Incendio. Revelio. What else is over here? Level one lock. Okay. Let's see. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before. Cool seeing that, uh... What is going on with this guy? Okay. 
<laughs> That's a little weird. Hey, poor guy. Uh, <laughs> four, two, six, so this is zero. And then five, one, six, we need five more. Where is that? Rebellion. Is that the other one? That's down. Five. We need five. What we need. Five. Yes, indubitably. Oh, it's full. and the map chamber. What? The map chamber? Where's the room of requirement? Hmm. Looks like my house chest has room for more tokens. Oh, we need five more. We only need five more wants me to test myself while under the influence of both the Maxima and Urgerish potions. I'd also like me to field test a focus potion. I know to find potions and recipes at J. Pippin's potions. Field guide will not guide me through this assignment, but my map could still prove, prove useful. Okay. In today's flying class, Madam Kago is reviewing basic broom flight and maneuverability. Ooh, yeah, let's go do that. All right, let's go acquire and use a focus potion, acquire maximum and urgers potions to use them simultaneously. Okay, let's go sell stuff. You go sell some things. I love the butterflies. Can we do anything at Olivanda's? Dogs meet, here I come. Gotcha. Assistance at all. 
Okay, yeah, I need some potions what can from I do you. for you today? I need to sell stuff. I didn't realize I had so much stuff. Don't need to sell the mystery ones. No, no. I hope to see you again. We get Maxima and Erdis potion. It's a cool looking uh, cloak. It's like a boxer's look, right? Let's sell that, and then we'll gotta buy Maximus, Maxima, Urtis, and Focus. What can I do for you today? Uh, we need a Focus. A wise decision. Thank you. Urtis. Maxima. Buy those. Sell this. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Doesn't say use it in anything though. Revelio. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? What the hell is going on here? Are you alright, guy? Okay. Alright. Well, let's go get the, uh, this side mission here, too. saying something oh hello talking to myself i'm clementine willetsy charmed i was musing on the precious butterflies i see near the edge of the forest whenever i come near they fly off into it when i was at hogwarts we truly were forbidden from entering the forest told horrible stories about it and i've had an irrationally intense fear of it ever since it's silly but I'm insatiably curious as to where the butterflies go in the forest. You couldn't possibly find out, could you? You want me to follow the butterflies? I do, yes, if you wouldn't mind. Sure. What were the horrible stories you were told about the Forbidden Forest? Oh, goodness, everything from students being mysteriously beheaded to terrifying Ooh. spider dens. Ugh. Trust me, you hear that at 11 years old, it sticks with you. Tell you, they're all true. Very well. All of it. If I have time, I shall see where they lead. I've seen oh, them all. how kind. Students these days have so much more courage than I ever did. You can usually find me right around here. I hope to see you soon. Oh, piece of dry skin hanging off my nose. All right, gotta follow the, the, the butterflies. butterflies. Always seem to be on the fringes of the Forbidden Forest. Good luck. Okay, 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 okay. All right, let's see here. Anything else? No, nothing. Cool. All right, we are good. Go back to our quests. Fire and use a focus potion. All right, let's use these potions then. Um, 
That looks pretty cool. That's pretty neat. Captain Look at that. Is sitting pretty in that camp of hers with all my <laughs> harvest earnings. My in potions class during the day, okay. Central Hall. Serious room beneath the restricted section. All right, let's attend potions class. How am I meant to concentrate on potions when Professor Sharp is so intimidating? I wonder what happened to his leg. Ooh, purple juice. All right, I attended. Boom. Done. How are your assignments coming along? Perfect. I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn the Pulso. Let's see what you can do. What is the Pulso? Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. Oh, you snuck a Y in there. He's a suit. You've got it now. If you'd like to practice, Accio. perhaps best. Classmates about the halls. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. Uh, they could also. Builds many types of objects and enemies with considerable force. Although it deals no direct damage to foes, enemies and objects alike can be launched into each other. Not destructive, with destructive results. Also useful for pushing and spinning objects of a variety of purposes. Also, well done. I'm glad to see that you seem staunchly determined to master your spell casting. Toads. Okay. Uh, I did. Still at it, I see. Well, repetition can be an excellent teacher. Okay, what do I do now? Is that it? Okay, that's it, I guess. You do more than one at a time. Let's do that one. And then we'll do the, the flying one. I'm sure there's another cauldron that I could use. Let's go ahead and do them. Is there anything new in here? It's the lock. Okay. 
I don't even think I need to go in there anymore. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. Alright, I think that's my last one I can make. Hey, get back here with my freaking potion. Boy! Yep, that's it. Okay. Come on, find the statue of the one eyed witch. Let's go. Wish I could sneak into the other. Wrong way. I don't know about Denny guy. What is going on? Can't catch bees! Uh. Oh, I supposed to go this way. Good job, good job. I gotta go upstairs. Well, excuse me, my bad. statue is far away. Very far away. Revelio. This looks like the right statue. A huge passageway hidden behind the statue of one eyed witch is a secret passageway from Hogwarts to the cellar of Honeydukes. It can only be accessed. Why is there a hidden passageway to Honeydukes? I just don't understand it. Like, why? Why is there. reputation to you. Why? Portrait depicts the wizard Barufio, bang for his brain elixir, and as an example of what happens when incantations are improperly spoken. Once he once said S instead of F, and found himself on the floor with a buffalo on his chest. Good job, guy. Revelio. <laughs> Meet me in my classroom to learn definitive severing charm. It's typically used to cut an object. But can be a powerful weapon when needed. Oh, such fun! Oh, Professor Stark wants to teach me another thing. Interesting. This portrait guards the Gryffindor common room, requiring a password from any who wish to enter. She and her friend Violet are known to wander among the other portraits, periodically help themselves to vats of wine there. Okay, we can't get in there, I guess. It'd be cool if we could, though. I'm very interested in seeing what the other ones are. How do we get over there, though? I don't know how to get over there. Probably through there. Probably where we gotta go. Revelio. All right, let's get through here. Sindo, right? Descendium. Descendium. Not the Sindo, not everything is oh I mean, this was all down there. Uh, not me. Not me at all. Revelio. That is cool. Whatever that is down there. A lift. Must be how I get down. Thing looks, looks broken though. Broke as hell, bro. Okay. Uh, I have a feeling. Hmm. 
I don't know. I need to fix the lift before oh, I hear it. Oh. Always forget about Repairo being old. That seems to have done the fixing trick. Fixing stuff and things. Makes sense, though. Something behind. Always. This castle will never cease to surprise me. Right? There's so much stuff, bro. Oh, spiders. Got more spiders. Incendio. Doesn't sound good. Celtic attire. This is where we came from. Uh. 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 It's not bad. I actually like that. I like the way that looks. Got the feather of Levioso on it. Have to so. get past this. Uh, maybe Repero? No, Levioso. Alright, let's see what's down here first. Rebellion. There's stuff down here. Uh. Is what it is. All right, now let's go on over. Janus. Incending. Repairing. One more to go, and I'll make it across. Something is getting in the way of that platform. Hmm. Hmm. Sad. There we go. That did the trick. Huh. 
Revelio. This must be the way out. Must be. I need to find a way to open that gate. Probably something to do with magic. Incendium. Something smells sweet. Must be close to honey dukes. Revelio. Right, nothing else. Nice. All right, let's grab these leaves and skadoot. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Honey dukes. I can smell the chocolate. Now, yeah. where would I find the dried billywig stings for Gallop? Mm. Probably somewhere down here. Rebellion. I have the dried billywig stings. Now, back to Gareth. I can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out. Nice. Very nice. Revelio. this guy doing you know there's one more down here we'll just grab this and then we'll go finish this up hey what do you do sweet Shop sells a variety of magical sweets to fizzling whiz beads and exploding bonbons. Customers would be wise to know precisely what effect they may experience before sampling the shop's wares. Hogsmeade, here. Revelio. Revelio, bitch. This is not one of those chests. Okay. Identified neck item. Nice. Nice. Revelio. This is one of those guys. Gotcha. Stuff's going down. We got these fireworks. Revelio. Likely left behind by a Hogwarts student visiting Hogsmeade, this enchanted confections hop around like real frogs, and each comes with a collectible card featuring famous witch or wizard. Yeah, I know what that is. Like the field guide pages in the Highlands. 
that was in one of them uh one of them Harry Potter movies. We really need to figure out how to get that uh that place so we can start identifying these things. Got a lot of them. One talent point. Let's do the stupid final one. Flex is not worried about challenges. Full guy pages in the Highlands. Okay. Alright, let's get back to. This bending for sweets. Here we go. Let's go back to the Great Hall. I'm a little hungry. I gotta go pick up the wife in like 30 minutes. So once uh once I do that, I'll just stop by Duncan or something. Up, bro. Hello, Gareth. I have those dried billywigs things. You got them? Incredible. I do. Here they are. Happy to help. Here you go. This is brilliant. Can't wait to get started. <laughs> Thank you again. I'll let you know when I brewed my first Can't batch wait for of you fizzing whiz beer. Blow stuff up, bro. I didn't get in trouble. You better not get me in trouble this time. I'd be, I'd be slightly upset at you. Right, let's see here. Let's check the quiz. Professor Sharp's assignment two. Acquire and use an invisibility potion. Acquire and use Thunderbrew potion against enemies. Okay. Let's go do that. We're gonna have to travel back to Ogsmead. Uh, right here. Next to next to the patients, to the patients. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Thunder brew and invisibility. Hello there. In the market for potions, are we? Sure. All right, let's sell this stuff. We don't need. That one. That one will keep all this mysterious stuff. I hope oh, to wait. see you again. Wanna... Farewell for now. Invisibility. A wise decision. Thunder Thank brew. you. Spending all this money Farewell for now. this crap. Use one against the enemy, darn. You got any more? Everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. A wise decision. Yeah, Thank I'm gonna set up my bed. I gotta read the full thing. Let's see, where do we go? Where do we go? Buff skin den. Merlin trial, small bandit camp. Spider lair, Vector's cave. Dark arts battle arena, what? Interesting. Maybe we'll do that more in this one too. Let's 
Nossa! Let's go up here. It's the spider lair. Well, go, didn't you? You're about to wish you hadn't. Who are you talking to? What? Incendio. What is going on? Dueling feats, bro. There's another guy down here. Where's this guy go? In the tree? So confused. Hmm. Interesting. Once I beat your Somebody butt. Saw that. I know, right? That was badass. Rebellion. That was slightly awesome there.
collection update, disarming charm three. Hmm. Can't pick it up. Can't pick it up. There we go. Now I can. So it's in here. I gotta do something with that. Maybe to Like that. So froggy. All right, let's get out of here. I don't trust Ranrock. I'll, I'll make you wish you were back in. I did it. And an Ashwinder, no less. Yeah, because it kind of sick. This is where I wanted to go. But turn it, I think. Let me go, sir. Akio. good here. We are good here. Right, let's go back to Hogwarts. Let's go back to the spells, potions. And learn this other spell. Ricardo. Have you finished your assignments? I finished the tasks, Professor. Well, well. I trust you are meticulous in your efforts. After all, shortcuts only ever lead to shortcomings. Ah, I see what you did there. All went perfectly well. Yes, sir, of course. Good. Ordinarily, I'd say it's not my concern either way, but you... I want to make sure you're well prepared. Talent and resolve are a potent combination. It would be a shame to let that go to waste. Thank you, Professor. Don't let it go to your head. Now, let's see how you fare with Defindo. Wand at the ready. Focus. Defindo can be dangerous if you're not paying attention. Hmm. 
Very good. It seems you have a grasp on Defindo. I would encourage you once again to practice here in the classroom, for your sake and that of everyone else. Sure. Slashes objects and enemies from afar dealing considerable damage. That sounds fun. That sounds like something I would love. It's a pleasure to have a Ooh. student who actually heeds instruction. Nice. That's strong. I like that. Okay. All right. Okay, where are my quests? All right, let's do flying. Ring set up. Everybody grab a broom and we shall get started. Mr. Clopton, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Welcome. Hello. Hello. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely, as broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Not a fan, I take it. <laughs> now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom, say up firmly and clearly, then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up! Thank you. Now, your turn. All right, let's try it. Up, you stupid ratty school broom! Wow. I have a feeling you're not gonna get be successful. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. If you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Okay. Good. Now, for your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Do take care. The brooms are school property. I want them returned in one piece. Wish I had my own broom. Ah, I think I'm getting the hang of this. Nice. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? Yeah. This next set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. What a view! <laughs> Totally. Made it. This oh, is awesome. Did anyone else see that? 
Ah, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as the first year. This is really cool, to be honest. Not including Quidditch. Very bad thing. Really should have done that. Ha, good. I've got this. Oh, well done. Have a moment. Nice. I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't properly met. I'm Everett Clopton. Am I right in suspecting that a Slytherin like you might be interested in making an escape from class? Hmm. <sighs> Can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. Sounds so creepy, bro. The tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely as ever. Let's hope the Headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? This is awesome, man. <laughs> Ahead of the gardens, the Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is Everett flying so quickly? Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. <laughs> now that's more like it. You sure you're not part Hippogriff? Nice. There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And the owlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tall Everett. That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Best hurry back. We're on it. Looks like she's already dismissed class. Better hurry and hand in our brooms. Dismount here. All right, dismount. Descend, ascend. Hold the dismount. Where have you two been? <laughs> oh, hello, Professor. <coughs> we were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for what? not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I'm disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor Enough. Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. Chin up. That was some rather good flying. Thanks. Kind of a badass if you haven't heard. Sorry about that business with Kagawa, but you have to admit those views were worth it. I have no regrets. <laughs> It was worth no a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. Yeah, probably. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spintwitch's in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. 
Let's do it. Let's get us a broom, bro. If I could afford the new Bright Spark broom at Spintwitches, I'd be on it now. Or was it Lower Hogsfield? Spintwitches is open in Hogsmeade. All the latest you brooms I have. Any Valerian That's that I we need really one. To have the broom I have at home is the latest model. Only I can't remember. I do like Madame Kagawa. I've not forgotten about our library venture. How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. I wish I could afford my own broom. Instead of using my brother's hand-me-downs. Madame Kagawa, about what happened in class. No need to discuss it further. Losing points for Slytherin should serve as a deterrent against future escapades. Now, Professor Weasley has asked that I teach you a few additional spells, so please keep an eye out for an owl from me. You're also welcome to drop by any time with questions. Okay, cool. Please meet me in the seventh floor corridor as soon as you can. I have an idea for somewhere you can focus on your studies, away from prying eyes and distractions. Okay. Well, I want to go visit Hogsmeade. Let's see if I can get a broom. That'd be amazing. Real nice, like, yep. Sometimes it seems a little. Uh, Perry, Pippin, and J. Pippin's potions and Hogsmeade sent me an owl regarding delivery. I should speak with him if I'm looking for some simple work. Okay, we can talk to him too. Professor Weasley has requested a meeting in the seventh floor corridor of Astronomy Tower. This is on location for a meeting. I wonder what she wants. Oh, that's where we get the, uh, the room of requirement. I can probably find Sebastian at his usual spot near the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. All right, so let's do this. Let's see if we can get a room here. Ah, ah new Revelio. Wonderful. Spent which is sporting needs run by Emil Albie Weeks. Shop sells a manner of wizarding sporting goods, including the latest broom models. Gossip around town is that Albi himself is working on a number of broom enhancements. That sounds cool. What's up, Albi? Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? Albi Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before <coughs> and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned, thankfully with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Got a few rare yew weavers available, ember dash, silver arrows, wind wisps too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. All right, uh, I'm gonna look at the rest. Disrupt disrupted trade routes may you be said close. disrupted trade routes caused you to close, Spint Witches. Terrible it's been. Trade routes reported as unusable. Evidently, criminals are overtaking roads, threatening hamlets. Mm, sounds like I gotta I can beat fly up safely some criminals. Almost anywhere, but you try flying with an inventory of brooms on your back. No easy feat. Right then, back to work. If a particular broom takes your fancy, just let me know. What else can you share about Do you brooms? mind sharing more about your brooms? I have a passion for them. Every detail of every model. Take wind wisps, well known for their quality ash handles. Yew weavers are rare because some fear flying them, likely to do with the Yew one's darker reputation. Then you add the ember dash, known for its handsome appearance. Working with brooms every day makes me practically giddy. It's one of many reasons I cherish running this shop. Let's Sounds look at your brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. What are we looking for today? You weaver, comfortable and speedy broom with a unique woven design. Stylish broom with a light touch, quite literally. Okay, let's start with Ember Dash, perfect broom for those who are fire temperament. That item is of the highest quality. That looks pretty cool, actually. I like that. 
room enchanters celebrate your particular Hogwarts house pride. That item is of the highest quality. Mm. Yeah. Finally crafted from ash, this room is built for stability. It's got side satchels. That's, eh. That item is of the highest quality. That is, eh. That's cool looking, but nah. Silas room with a light touch, quite literally. This one, you weaver broom, comfortable and speedy broom with That item is of the highest quality. I'm gonna do Ember Dash, bro. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. You'll be thrilled. With you. What does thrilled mean? Oh, you can buy all the brooms? Nice. Thanks for stopping by. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements? Go on. Yeah. Ah, knew I was right about you. Get out of freaking broom, bro. You'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may <coughs> notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. Ooh. What I need is someone to conduct a broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Reyes, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? Yep, sounds good. How long have you had a passion for brooms? Since the moment I saw my first Quidditch match. Seeing flyers maneuver the way they do. Oh, some people it continue to cool. have their doubts about me and my ideas. I hope that won't dissuade you from helping. I know I'm onto something. That is one thing I would love to do is like fly. Why do you need me to report to you on this broom flight? I did try to get Imelda to help, but she has some flying habits and quirks that made her difficult to collaborate with. I need a flyer with no bad habits and the knack for flying. Your classmate Everett said you're a natural on a broom. He's forever in here studying the newest models, almost as passionate about brooms as I am. If your rumored talent for flying can help you beat Imelda's times, then having you assess the broom will be invaluable. I was talking about asses, but it says assess. Sounds as if you took Kagawa's class. I did, but my focus on the technical elements of brooms rather than the art of flying drove her mad. She thinks it fit in I run <coughs> spin witches now. I don't reckon either of us ever pictured me batting away bludgers for the cannons or puddle me United. And I find a certain satisfaction in winning over the naysayers who think I may be too young to run this shop. With your help, I can continue proving myself the most knowledgeable purveyor of wizarding sporting goods around. Yeah, I help. That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Reyes will sort you out. Perfect. Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. Yeah, no problem. How can certain area, other areas where you flying look? Oh, uh, okay. Ah, I can't help but admire Mr. Weeks' enthusiasm. Oh, that's not where I want to go. First, teaching students. Now you go to the potion shop, which is up this way. Right. It's up here, right? No. Here we go. It turned around a little bit. Welcome. Do let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. Hello, Mr. Pippin. You need help with the delivery? Yes, I do. A capable student such as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. What do you need delivered? Fatima Lawang ordered a few invisibility potions. I used to go myself, but lately Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. 
constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. Mm. But how can I maintain excellence which you order so often, giving me no time to brew? If you take this rather irritating task off my hands, I'd happily allow you to claim the delivery fee from Fatima. Ah, sure, yeah. I'd be happy to help with the delivery. You've no idea how grateful I am, truly. Here are the invisibility potions she requested. Hopefully she won't give you too much trouble. She's a talented potioner in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. Mm. Is that what the kids call on it nowadays? Looking at her potions. Potion recipes. Deliver three to her. Oh man, how far? Oh, she is far. Okay. Wow. All right. And we'll do that later. We'll do that later. I do have to get ready to go, though. All right, let's, uh, room requirement. Let's try to do this before I gotta go. Hey, stop. Get it. Get it. my freaking. Scratching up my chair. Stop. She has tons of scratching posts, and she comes over here and tries to scratch I my chair. I would stand for that. But if I said it was for an essay for history of magic... Oh, okay, excuse me. All right, what's in here? Professor Weasley? Hmm. I look so worried. Somewhere away from prying eyes. Well, there's some secret here. Hi, what is this? Forgive me, the headmaster stopped me and I... Merlin's beard. I see you've wasted no time. Well done. I don't even know how I did it. Shall we? After you, Professor. Stop. What is this place? This is the womb of requirement. No. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Ordinarily, a student might stumble upon this room entirely by accident. If ever. I'd only planned to suggest to you how to find it Pretty by awesome. walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. But you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Now, where is Deke? Hmm, he must have sneaked past and gone ahead. Deke, Professor? The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. <sighs> There's no chance I'm clambering over this mess. Hmm. This presents the perfect opportunity to teach you Evanesco, the vanishing spell. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. Okay. Evanesco. Splendid. Now, cast Evanesco on those chairs.
Oh, here we go. Excellent work. Oh. You'll note that you are now nice. in possession of Moonstone. Mm -hmm. We shall discuss its uses later. Let's move on. I have a lot of that. Yes, I do. Where in Merlin's name is that elf? Oh, there's something right here. Is that... Goodness. Ah. My old school bag. I wondered where that had got to. Hey, I waited for. I believe it's still here. Can you shut up? I'll just take a quick look at this, give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Deke. Okay. Yes, Professor. I waited for you for here for ages. Perhaps you were assigned a few more inches of parchment than you'd expect. Let me know if you want to try to meet again. Sincerely, T. Hmm. Who is this? Revelio. There's some chests over there. There's a lot of chests over here. Oh, dear me. Can't you keep it down? Some of us are trying to rest. Well, excuse me, God. Yeah. Okay. Revelio. There's a chest up there. I hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. An intruder! Stop! Revelio! Intruder? What are you talking about? Oh, not... Uh, that's not helpful, you worthless pile of tin! <laughs> well... I don't think that works for you. Revelio! Bit offended the room thought I needed a bath, cheeky thing. something. No, that's the thing to get up there. Oh, we did miss something. self-managed to get around in here. Right? It's crazy. What was that? 
That's a bug. Was that a golden stitch? Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. Revelio. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what's through here. Rebellion. Akio. Okay. Something wrong. Oh, okay, here we go. This is what I gotta do. Here. Akio. The bolts up. Akio. Levioso. Akio. Levioso. Oh no. Got it. There's a lot of broom upgrades. Okay, nice. I like that. Revelio. I hope that house elf can find us in here. What's that? Oh, there he is. Yikes! Careful! Huh? Oh, there you are! Wait right there. Deke will come to you. So with my Hello. Luke. Ah, we've been
All right, sorry. Wife called, I'm about to have to go, so let's get, uh, get this done as quick as possible. I'm already starting doing this, so, so. We got this. And it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar items of clothing. Oh, I need that. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. You have unlocked the desk of description. Use it to reveal magical properties of unidentified gear that you've collected. Perfect. That's what I need. Ooh. Yeah. Cool. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. Okay. Revelio. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Now, I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes. The magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Boom. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. I did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much safer and easier to purchase them. They can also be collected by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Mm. Mm, quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plots and brew potions in class. Perfect. That's stuff that I need. Scientific potion station, small botanic potion station, small electrical potion station, optic potion station. It's a difference. Just the way they look. Okay, how do I rotate? Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, 
conjuring a potting table. you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. Dequil 